most of the time the big big, big projects like this normally be done by the foreigners. Jogging on Dar es Salaam, on our way to the arts and craft Our people center. So yes family, on the way to the Caribou Arts and Craft Gallery so we can view the showcase of Tanzania rich cultural heritage and skills. Found in paints, art, carving, basquery, weaving, jewelry, and African apparel. And this is a nice uh, neighborhood that we are driving through to get there. And it's giving you a, a feel of some parts of our Tanzania as best as we can. And this is a mega city. And unfortunately, uh, we're only here for two nights. So this day is full tour day, city tour, national museum, village museum. We have also the, the crazy mad market. The traffic is crazy. So right now it's the you know, middle of the day, so things are not bad. But what you want to do is make sure you get out of the city early enough to where you're just not stuck where you're going uh, two miles an hour. So this is that new road. Yep. And it's there to cut traffic through. It will help. So one of the things you also seen is this new roads, this new development, this okay, it's a whole lot of enterprising. Paradise there, so we're just taking it in from different points of view of Tanzania. So, Rusha, Dar es Salaam, and Zanzibar Island give you a good little feel of the country. And as the future progress, our goal is to you know, modify and, you know, and adjust the schedule. So, so, this is a foundation building that we're going to take to another level. And so far, everything has been just wonderful. So yes, family, building the energy as we move around in Dar es Salaam.
Ryan's family so we're taking a scenic route and as you see traffic has been light and that's why you want to have experienced guides and experienced drivers when you do, that, do these journeys because you're looking to you know do the best logistic operation